the Smart Notebook How To video series. This video is How To Use Smart Response 2 and this is for students. A teacher creates a Smart Response 2 assessment in a notebook file and students can access it in a browser. When your teacher is ready to start the assessment, they'll present you with the activity code. You can see here the browser URL, classlab.com, and the activity code you need to access the assessment. I'm John's student and I'm going to access the assessment now. I go to classlab.com and I'm going to enter the activity code. I'm going to press enter. I type in my name, John, and I press join the activity. Right now I see the teacher hasn't started the activity yet and I'm going to wait. I'm when the teacher starts the assessment, I can start answering all of them until I'm completely done. There are two solstices in a year. I'm going to press two because that's true. And at the top, I'm going to press the arrow to continue to the next question. When I'm done answering the last question, at the top I can see I've answered seven out of seven questions. I press the arrow and this opens up a review window where I can review and change any of my answers. I want to take a look again at question number two. I'm going to press number two and the assessment opens again to question two. I can keep the answer I have or I can change it. I'm going to keep it and then over on the top right I'm going to press the hamburger and I can continue to review all my questions and answers and when I'm done I'm going to press submit all answers. I see a warning to make sure I'm okay to submit and I press submit. When everyone is done the teacher ends assessment and I can see my questions and answers. Question one I answered it correctly. My answer is highlighted in blue with a green check mark beside it. Question number two, I answered incorrectly. My answer is highlighted in blue and there's a red X beside it with a green check mark beside the correct answer. I can review all the questions and answers one by one by using the arrow to scroll through them all or I can go to the top right corner and press the hamburger to see all the questions listed and my percentage score at the bottom of the window. At the display, the teacher ends the assessment and then immediately reviews the questions and the answers. And the teacher can continue to review all the questions until she's done. She can stop the review at any time and she can export the results to a spreadsheet and discuss the results later. Thanks for watching this video. Check out the other videos in this how-to video series.